Intercontinental ballistic missile ICBM is still the backbone of the nuclear power of America and Russia. Both of them each have the ultimate weapon that will be used to melt opponents in the event of a nuclear war. Currently Russia relies on the RS-18 Satan. While America has the LGM 30G Minute Main Third how do the two compare? Russia itself calls this weapon the R-35M which was developed from the R-36 NATO calls it the SS-9 SCARP. The R-35 was first tested in 1971 and eventually evolved into the R-36M family, known in the West as the SS-18 Satan. A first batch of 56 missiles were deployed in 1977. These missiles were later replaced by a more modern variant with the newest being the R-36M2 Voyevoda which was first deployed in 1988. The SS-18 Satan is a very capable missile, mainly due to its high speed and very high throw weight. Russia and is still ahead of the West in the development of missile engines even by America. R-36M2 missile has a range of 11,000 km and carries up to 10 MIRV with a blast yield of 0.75-1 MT and up to 40 penetration aids. So its nuclear warheads are difficult for air defense systems to intercept. It is this power that has no equal today. CEP of this missile is 220 meter. While not the most accurate missile, it can shut it down in terms of payload. Some sources report that one SS-18 Satan missile with MIRV can destroy three American states, such as Maryland, Vermont and Rhode Island. Satan is a silo-based missile whose location is scattered throughout Russia. The silo launchers and command points are in a very strong building capable of countering a nuclear explosion. However, the position of these missiles was or was quickly known. The number of Satan missiles in service continues to decline with age. Missiles past operational life have been recalled. There are currently an estimated total of 58 R-36M2 missiles deployed by the Russian Strategic Missile Force. Now let's look at the LGM 30G Minute Main Third. This is the most ICBM in the United States. This missile entered service in 1970 and was the first missile to introduce a capable MIRV. Despite its old age, various improvement programs are being implemented to maintain its combat effectiveness until it is expected to be operational until 2030. Minute Man Third is a silo-based missile. With the retirement of the LGM-118 in 2005, the Minuteman III has become America's only ground-based ICBM currently in operation and is a pivotal force in America's nuclear trinity. There are 450 missiles of this type in the American service with 50 to 75 other missiles in reserve. This number makes it the ballistic missile with the largest number in the world. The downside is that this missile is stationary and its position is known. The Minuteman third missile has a maximum range of 13,000 km. The inertial navigation system provides it with an accuracy of about 200 m CEP, but the updated inertial guidance system gives it a CEP of 120 m. The Minuteman third carries MIRV payloads, each armed with a nuclear warhead with a destructive power of between 300 and 500 kilotons. The missile also carries penetration aids against enemy missile defense systems. In terms of the range of the Minuteman third, it is much longer than the SS-18, but the range of 11,000 is also far more than enough to attack America from Russian territory. While the CEP is pretty much the same, for nuclear missiles, missing 200 meters is not a problem because it would still be just as devastating. 
the strength of the explosion, the throwing power and the speed that made Minuteman finally still under the SS-18. But the Minuteman third is quite agile and has the longest reach. And the numbers are so large that it is a very deadly force.